Stephen Jill here. Hello. Welcome to the Land Academy Show, entertaining land investment talk. I'm Stephen Jack Butella. And I'm Jill DeWitt, broadcasting from sunny Southern California. Today, Jill and I talk about outsourcing, funding your deals with Plum Investment. You know, right before the show, Jill said, you know, this should be a show with Justin. Justin Sleva, you know, which, who does the show on Friday with mm-hmm. me called Finance Friday, because he's the back, he is Plum Investment. Mm-hmm. And I said, no, no, wait a second. What the show is really about is how a member of ours, after about a year or so, and getting some good experience and really succeeding at this, stepped up and provided a product that we are not innately interested in providing for a lot of reasons. But it makes us stronger as a group. Mm-hmm. And it get, it, the real win for us is that we get more members. We get a bigger, intelligent community of people who are doing deals so we can do deals with them. And he wins because he provides financing and makes a little dough on that. So mm-hmm. it's more of a discussion between uh, Jill and I and listeners um, without Justin himself, which we'll talk about. Justin will join us on Friday to cool. celebrate that, you know. Exactly. Before we get into it, though, let's take a question posted by one of our members on the LandInvestors.com online community. It's free. Stephen asks, have any of you used an escrow for a reduced fee to just review the documents and generate a preliminary title report for the buyer on a terms deal where the title will not change until the land contract terms are met and the parties are okay transferring funds directly? So no escrow service needed for that function. That is brilliant. Oh, I love the concept, yeah. mm-hmm. um, but I'm not so sure an escrow person is who you want. What you want is maybe a paralegal who's who's done a bunch of deals. There are a lot of paralegals who become paralegals before they're attorneys and they have no experience at all. Mm-hmm. So, <clears throat> excuse me, what you want is probably to hire a law firm, and you're going to get sticker shock over this, but it's a great question, and I love the concept because you want to get everything done right. Uh, but the unfortunate answer is, yes, you can do it. It's going to be expensive. And the first time you do it, by the way, you need to look over their shoulder every step of the way and learn because it's going to be eventually you who's going to do it. Or you could use that escrow because escrow companies do do terms deals all the time. Mm-hmm. They're just not land contract deals. Right. They're deed of trust deals like a mortgage. And I don't want to get too complicated here, but that's not really how you want to do a terms deal. However, I mean, I can't express this enough. Having a second set of eyes to look over this stuff is brilliant. Never crazy. Today's topic, outsourcing funding with Plum Investment. This is the meat of the show. I see this as filling a a huge need that, like kind of the missing piece. You know, here's- Me too. Because let me me back up. Land Academy, I I wrote it down. It's kind of like there's like five, five pieces. So you want to do this business. Well, number one, you need to have the knowledge. Well, check. Land Academy came along and covered that. Number two, you got to have access to the data. You, well, check. We check. got that. Then we've got to have mail. Got to get got to get the data out to the offers. Well, we created offers to owners. Check. We have that. Next, you got to have um, do, do all the tools and things around doing due diligence and closing the deal. Well, check. We covered that too. So the last... Partial facts and inforeports.com do that perfectly well. As well as Title Pro 24-7 and other things in our in our toolbox, if you will. And then the last thing was darn funding. So oh. great. You've got a deal. You've done your due diligence. You're sitting there looking at this great deal. You, you are about to pay ten grand for it. You know it's worth 35000 bucks. I don't have ten grand. Yeah, shucks. What do I do? And here comes Justin. And here comes and where so and where you find this, by the way, if you go to landinvestors.com, our online community, at the very top, there's a menu item that says deal funding, and that's what we do and just fill that out. So it's awesome. And you do not have to be a member, by the way. Um, although we want you to be a member. Do you need to be a member? I don't know. I think there's a box that you check. Now that I think about it, because I know he said he said people come to him that are not members. As I'm, I'm opening, you do up not a, have to. Be tell me to open up a whole can of worms now here. That I'm thinking about it. I don't think you technically have to because a good deal, everybody's going to get. I mean, we will fund a good deal. Someone will fund a good deal. Slash, however, I will say this: we all know what we all know, and we know that people who are members of Land Academy, we know what the due diligence went into. They, we know how they pick the county. We know all the things that they checked ahead of time. So the deals are usually more, uh, are usually better deals going through the process. So they definitely get pushed to the top. And there's no way you can know this. I mean, yeah. half of half the listeners are sitting here thinking, I don't need Land Academy. Yeah. I know. I've done 15 deals. Right. 
I've done it with Jack Bosch. I've done it with LandGeek. I get it. Half the people that are with us in our membership group has said the same thing. Yeah, and they all came from other things, and I think it's great. So I can... We can fill in the pieces. There's There are some holes, and we'll help you with yeah. that. <laughs> That's a nice way to say that. Thank you. I was going to say a bunch of other stuff, but so, I won't. Okay. But the, whole, the point of the show today, though, is about um, this member um, taking it upon himself to create this... Uh, uh, funding source basically and helping everybody make more money really by completing deals that they were having trouble getting funding here's the true gem of what's possible with plum investment and again Justin and I'll talk about it on Friday we, all, we every Friday we talk about it you don't have to have any money to do this right, that's that is a, a game changer for joining land academy and eventually house academy And you shouldn't, because you shouldn't sit around and say, well, I have $15,000 that I've allocated in my life to spend on acquisitions. I'm going to join Land Academy, learn how to do it. I'm going to spend this $15,000. I'm going to turn it into 30. I'm going to down $30,000. I'm going to turn it into 60. Well, that's how we have been. That's that's a concept that you should never lose in your mind, but you don't have to start. You don't have to. You're not, you can start with, let's say you have a hundred thousand dollar deal that you bring in because you're great at Zeta and and it's worth 300 This just happened. Right. Because this is how... That's the kind of deal that now you got... Then you're going to split that? You're going to split that with Justin? The proceeds of that? I mean, you're not, that's going to launch your career. It's, you don't have to have any money to start. You don't have to. Truly. I don't want to... like these guru stupid shows. Well, you know, but that's what that's what I want to make sure we're talking about. I don't want to sound like that, Stephen, because that's not exactly what we're saying. And we have always told people what we don't want you to ever do is take out a credit card and do that kind of a thing. Save up the money if you need it to get going. Do this right. Um, and we have always said to pay cash, buy your own thing. But I think for me, as a new person... What always happens, you're going along, maybe you're buying $1,000 properties and flipping them for three, and then you can move to $5,000. Invariably, there's going to be someone that calls back and goes, and you say, what else do you have? And they go, well, actually, um, my dad and I own uh, 160 acres over here. You wouldn't be interested in that, would you? And this is where you can now go, wow, I would. And for most people, then they panic. And they and they are they feel like, I don't have that kind of money. Now you do. That's how I I see it. It's because I don't want to change what we've said in the past. Well, I'm not, you know, this is a new tool. Yes. And so I I think that the difference, it doesn't matter. I mean, you're listening to the show, so you know the difference. Right. You really, truly don't have to have any money. Let let me rephrase that. You got to send out the mail. How you send out the mailers and how you price the mailers and the properties that you're fishing for. Don't have to be thousand dollar properties. That's they don't have to be tied point. to Thank your you. uh, money that you've allocated to do this. Correct. You can shoot for the moon now, and if it's a smoking, smoking deal yep. that fits within Plum's investment criteria, and frankly, us too, we do some deals too. Uh, now you're now you're okay. You know, you can get a lot farther, a lot faster. As ironic as it sounds, that's true. A lot farther, a lot faster financially without using your own money, with that's using true. Plum. That's true. You know, does that mean? And it's not like you're having to call your dad or call your rich uncle or, or use something your like money. that. Exactly. So even if you do have fifteen or twenty or thirty thousand bucks, you know, use it on some deals. And but this is what we do: we use some money for our deals, some of our money for deals, and some on bigger deals we use other people's money mm-hmm. in a very responsible way. So it's a good thing. I mean, this is a total game changer. And we yeah. don't, you know, we don't celebrate stuff enough. You know why we don't? And I don't. Why? Because I don't want to sound all salesy. Because I don't, I don't want to be like, you know, like you just said. Yeah. You don't have to have any money. To, no. Yeah, money I don't want to say that. No money down. Yeah, I don't want to say that's that. The worst thing ever. Anybody, Nothing more terrible. Anybody can do this. I don't want to say that too. Right. <laughs> it's a lot of work. It's easy. We'll show you the way. I don't want to say that because I'm not going to hold your hand the whole time. You got to learn this yourself. Right. There's a lot you got to bring to the table. You know. So, um, and this. Anyway, I'm just. I'm happy to celebrate this too because this is something great that one of our people has done. Oh, go ahead. Sorry. I was going to end it. Okay. Well, then good. I'll say what I have to say for the after show. Well, you've done it again. You spent another, ten, spent another 10 minutes or so listening to the Land Academy show. Join us next time where we discuss outs- outsourcing your transaction with TitleMind.com. Cool. And we answer your questions posted on our online community, LandInvestors.com. It's free. You are not alone. 
in your real estate ambition. What were we going to say, Joe? Happy birthday to oh, you. Oh, really? Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday, dear Stephen. Happy birthday to you. <laughs> I was going to do the beginning. I thought, no, wait. And I couldn't say the middle. No, wait. <laughs> so now here at the end, it's Tuesday. Today's your birthday. I have something really fun planned for you tonight. Tell me. I'm not going to tell you. <laughs> I certainly That's can't really say good. it here. Julie, <laughs> 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 you're the best. <gasps> Thank you. What were you doing recently? And I'm just like, That's a so, you are so the right girl for me. <laughs> oh, we went to Costco. It was oh. spent. This happens a lot. Ah, that was funny. You know, when you own a company like this and there's lots of employees and they're constantly starting another company and and so it starts like this. Oh, yeah, we really do need a couple of new computers. Oh, yeah, we, it'd be cool to have an electronic dashboard up on the wall. Yeah. So Jill and I went to Costco during the middle of the day because there's fewer people there and we... <laughs> yeah. We're walking out and there's carts full and Jill, and Jill says, you know, this is my kind of Costco run. We've got yeah. consumer electronics, computers, and alcohol. That's all that was. Alcohol no and electronics. There's no clothes. There's nothing. And I'm like, man. <laughs> no toilet just, paper. It's moments like that. <laughs> it's moments like that. You know, you just know you're with the right person when they say stuff like that. Like that GPS coordinate thing yesterday. Oh, thank you. I appreciate that. <laughs> and I appreciate you and happy birthday. Thank you. <laughs> hey, wherever you are listening or watching, please be sure and rate us there. We, we are, are Stephen Jill. Jill. Information. And inspiration. To buy undervalued property. <laughs>